So it has been nearly a decade since R&B singer Mario put out new music, but he's back with a new album and on tour with B2K. I had a chance to sit down with him and he opened up about his new music. Let's take a look. You should let me love you. You should let me love you. Let me be the one to, don't let me hang in. Everything you want and Okay, me. man, you sound way better Baby, than good I do. Love and <laughs> I told you you do those warm ups, they help. You the warm ups help. way better than I do. So how's the tour going? Amazing, amazing. We just came from Detroit. Uh, we played a sold out show last night. Yesterday was an amazing show. He released Dancing Shadows last year. Yes, yes. We're talking almost eight years that mm -hmm. we had heard from you. You, yes. of course, well, were doing some mm -hmm. acting. We mm -hmm. could get into that in a second. Mm -hmm. But what's this re resurgence of Mario? Where's this coming from? I mean, it's coming from a place of growth. It's coming from a place of uh, inspiration. You know, there was a period of time where I was going through a lot of business changes within the label I was working with. When you're making those transitions, you want to make sure that you're doing it the right way, you're making the right music. And I felt a lot of pressure to also put an album together that was very authentic to me. And I feel like Dance and Shadows is exactly that. Talk to me about Rent. You recently starred in there and you played the yeah. role of Benny, Tay Diggs. Yes. Was that an intimidating role? Intimidating, no. I think the experience was a bit intimidating because okay. I had never done Broadway in, in that way before because it was so multidimensional in terms mm -hmm. of the stage, in terms of the, the process. And it because was it was live, you know, on, on television, I enjoy the process of getting to know myself as a team player in that way. As an artist, you can be selfish in so many ways. Yeah. With your shows, you can change things last minute. But with Broadway, or with a play like Rent, you know, you have to keep the authenticity. So it was an incredible experience, I learned a lot. Who is the real Mario? Oh, who's the real Mario? Yeah. I mean, to be honest with you, I had this conversation with a friend last night. I feel like I'm me all the time. Okay. But then people will be like, well, when you do interviews, like you, there's certain parts of you, or when you're on stage, it's a different you. And it, so I think that naturally, and as a Virgo, you, have these different levels to yourself. <laughs> I think I'm the same person, but with different levels. I come to Inglewood, then maybe we can smoke. We need your music. You Thank make you. love music. And I, I want to ask you, where do you think R&B is today? R&B is still alive, you know, I think that the millennial tour shows that R&B is still alive, you know. I think there is hip hop on the show, but I think the majority of that audience comes there to hear R&B, in my opinion. r and is always gonna be alive because the heart of it is still there, you know. Okay. And I'm still here. And Mario is here. Soon. I'm never gonna stop because of you. And I love you. <laughs> thank you. It's amazing. Thank you. Oh, thank mm -hmm. you. I appreciate the love. You already got it. <laughs> Pull up the lavender blue. Oh my gosh, did you guys see that? He gave me a kiss. It was cute. All right, so Mario, he is going to be back with B2K along with Chingy and the Ying Yang Twins for the Millennium Tour on Saturday. I was there last night. You guys got to get your tickets for Saturday. There has to be a few left. They're going to be at the Wintrust Arena near McCormick Place. There's myself and Kendra G. Um, as you can see, we had a really, really good time. Um, check out LiveNation.com for all the ticket info.